He was not like the others. While the world rushed forward, Einstein stood still and thought. In a small room with just paper, a pencil, and his mind, he reshaped the universe. Born in Germany in 1879, he barely spoke as a child. Teachers called him slow, distracted, even hopeless. But inside, his imagination was infinite. He didn't see the world as it was, he saw it as it could be. At 16, he dreamed of chasing a beam of light. What if he caught it? Would time stop? Would space twist? That question became the foundation of modern physics. Years later, in a small patent office in Switzerland, he wrote papers that changed everything. He proved that space and time are one fabric, bent by gravity. The greater the mass, the stronger the curve, that curve is reality. He didn't need labs or machines. He used thought, mind experiments. He could see the universe with his eyes closed. In 1905, he published E equals MC2, energy equals mass times the speed of light squared. Those symbols revealed the hidden link between matter and energy, the secret of stars, the fire of the sun, and the creation of the atom bomb. Einstein didn't just study the universe, he rewrote it. But the genius who defied reality was haunted by it. When the first nuclear bomb exploded, he said, the world has changed, but I fear it has not become wiser. He spent his life searching for something greater, a single equation to explain everything, the theory of everything, the key to the mind of God. He never found it, but he left us something powerful, a way to see beyond what we believe is possible. Einstein taught us that time is not a line. It bends, stretches, and can fold back on itself. Reality is not fixed. It's a question waiting for a brave mind to answer.